Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Canon LPP6030 printer driver in a Windows 7 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First, we check our machine is 32 bit or 64 bit. That is very easy. Go to the computer, right click on the computer, go to the properties, click on the properties. In properties, find system type. If system type is 32 bit, that means that machine is 32 bit operating system machine. If you find 64 bit at here, then that machine is 64 bit operating system machine. This machine is 32 bit operating system machine. Close it. This machine is 32 bit operating system machine. Close it. After that, we go to the, our download settings or the download options. Go to the any web browser that you like. I am going to the Google Chrome. Here type Canon LBP6030 driver and hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from the Canon, but go to the, this link, support, then image class LBP6030, LBP6030BW, it is a series of this printer, open that link, I give this link in the YouTube description also, open that link, here we find your printer names, and after that here we find drivers, go to the drivers, here we find operating system if it's not detect your operating system right then select this in this case it is not detect my operating system click at here and find windows 7 windows 7 32 bit then go to the windows 7 plane windows 7 64 bit then go to the windows 7 64 bit in my case it is in windows 7 so i go to the plane windows 7 32 bit it is in 32 bit go to the search here we find many options go to the first option 32 bit or 64 bit i'm going to the first option here we find download, here we find yes, click on the yes, I, I agree with terms and condition and our download is started at here. It is not a very big or heavy file, it's a few seconds or few minutes depending on the speed of your internet. So be a patient and wait for few seconds or few minutes. Our download is now complete, click on show all. Here we find show in a folder, minimize it, close it and drag this set of file to desktop, close it. This is the our setup file. This setup file is an actual zip file and we are going to unzip this zip file. That is very easy and simple. Right click on it. Here we find extract files. Click on the extract files. Click on the OK. It's extract our files on the desktop. Here we find double click on it. And here we find one folder on this folder. We find UFR double I double click on it. UK English, double click on it. If your machine is 64 bit, then go to the 64 bit. If 32 bit, then go to the 32 bit. In my case, it is a 32 bit, so I go to the 32 bit. Here we find many options. Go to the here setup or go to the here drivers. Here we find drivers and we are going to install these drivers manually. That is very easy and simple. Click at here. Here we find close option, close it. After that, we are going to install our printer manually. That is very easy. Go to the start. Here we find control panel. Click on the control panel. In control panel, find devices and printers. Find devices and printers. Click on the devices and printers. In devices and printer, at the top, we find add a printer. Click on the add a printer. Click on add a printer two times. After that, new option is pop up. Minimize it. Here we find many options in add a printer. Go to this option, add a local printer. Click on add a local printer. Here we find existing port. Port is the most, most IMP part in this installation. Go to the here and select any USB port that you want. USB 001, 002, 003, 004. Go with the any USB port that you want. I go with the USB port. Click on the next. Here we find have a disk. Go to the browse. Go to the desktop. Here is our fo folder or the setup file. Double click on it. UFR double I. Double click on that folder. UK English. Double click on it. Here we find 64 bit. If your machine is 64 bit, then go to the X64. If your machine is 32 bit, then go to the 32 bit. My case 32 bit. So I go to the 32 bit. Go to the driver. Here we find one single file. Select that single file. Click on open. Click on OK. Here we find our Canon LBP 6030 6040 6. 018. This is a series of this all printers. Select that. Click on the next button. You can give any name that you like. I'm going to 6030. You can give any name that you like. Click on the next. It's installing our printer. It's install our printer. If you want to print a test page, then click on a printer test page or click on the finish. Next step is check our printer is properly installed or not. That is very easy and simple. Go to the start. Go to the control panel, click on the control panel. In control panel, find devices and printers. Click on devices and printers. 
in devices and printer if you find canon lpp6030 that means your printer is properly installed and it's work 110 percent on your windows 7 pc or laptop so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys